Hello and thank you for paying attention to this video. Uh, in this video, I'm going to uh, mention the uh, prerequisite courses needed for uh, biological schools, uh, including medical, dental, and mainly pharmacy schools, my profession. So the courses that you need almost in every pharmacy school uh, in order to be able to enter if you don't have a bachelor's degree, uh, I would uh, briefly uh, discuss or name the courses that you need to take. Uh, these are for United States pharmacy schools, and so we're going to start. First, uh, at least in my case, I had uh, uh, two courses of U.S. history. So U.S. history, two courses. And then uh, the second uh, subject matter is U.S. government. If you live in USA, uh, you have to take that course, U.S. government. This was also two courses, one and two, so two semesters, three hours each. So this one was six credit hours. And this one was six credit hours as well. Then we had uh, the courses uh, that are biological. So uh, put number three, biology one and two, which is each one has labs. So these are four hours each for a total of eight credit hours. So two courses, biology one, biology two. Then you have to take um, four courses of chemistry. So I put chemistry, uh, which is in organic chemistry. You need two courses for this plus organic chemistry. So this one is uh, eight hours because it's two courses, and this one is eight hours. So you see, you, have, you need a lot of chemistry. So a total of 16 hours for chemistry. Then we have, um, I had two physics. I believe most schools require two, or some places may require only one physics. Physics one and two. Each one has a lab, so it's a total of eight hours. You also need, uh, let me see, so we mentioned these are the main ones, basically chemistry, biology, physics, government. Then you need English, uh, you know, six. One, uh, I had one course of English. Some places they may require two. I also had a technical writing, which is not required, but I mean, the more, the better to know the language. The English course was only three hours, but I had technical, so I had three plus three, that's six hours. These are the main courses now. Most schools require other uh, courses as well, like cultural courses or um, foreign language courses that you know, most people take Spanish if you live in Texas or southern United States. Um, so these are the main courses. I mean, you have to really score high on these subject matters that I mentioned here to have a solid background and move towards uh, your medical profession. I also recommend to take biochemistry courses. If you can, that would prepare you better for pharmacy school. So two courses of biochemistry. Uh, I also had genetics. I'm not sure if it's required, but genetics also helps you to prepare for pharmacy school. Thanks for your attention to this program. Thank you.